Today, we delve into an intriguing history of the fiery root that has forged its way from the kitchen into the realm of medicine, and that's ginger spice. For over the last 30 years, the medicinal benefits of ginger have been well researched, and today we'll reveal how this little spice has incredible benefits for your nerve health. And make sure you watch this video until the end, because I'll share with you an incredible ginger elixir that will boost your immune system and can stop a chronic cough instantly. In part one, we'll talk about ginger's fascinating history. Then in part two, we'll delve into the amazing health benefits. And finally, in part three, I'll reveal how you can incorporate ginger into your diet. So brace yourself as we unveil the captivating tale of ginger root and its remarkable journey from ancient spice to an all natural remedy for nerve pain and so much more. Trust me, it's gonna be good. explorers. If you've been told neuropathy is permanent, I'm here to help you achieve new levels of health you've never dreamed possible. So make sure you click on the subscribe button for up-to-date and accurate information on peripheral neuropathy and what you can do to overcome it. Also, don't forget to click on the bell to get notified as soon as we publish new, new content. All right, let's get started. Part one, the fascinating history of ginger. Once upon a time in the vibrant lands of Southeast Asia, a humble ginger root was revered for its aromatic zest and captivating flavor. As it made its way across the continents, many ancient cultures began to discover the healing properties of this powerful spice. China cherished this flower and plant for its healing properties, especially for stomach upset and nausea. Later on, India adopted ginger as a potent herbal treatment for their Ayurvedic medicine. Now, this is a natural form of, of medicine established in India many thousands of years ago. Ayurveda is considered to be a formal medical care system in India, equivalent to our conventional Western system here in the US. And it's estimated that 80% of India's population, which is approximately 1.2 billion people, still use some form of traditional Ayurvedic medicine. Ginger's ability to ease digestion and reduce inflammation has caught the attention of holistic healers worldwide. But it wasn't until modern science placed it under the microscope that Ginger's true potential was revealed. Starting back in the early 1990s, scientists began to stand up and take note of Ginger and its claim to improve digestion, increase memory, clear hepatic obstructions, dissipate phlegm, and stop diarrhea caused by food poisoning. As a result, clinical studies on ginger began to take place. All right, that takes us on to part two, ginger's health benefits. Over the last 30 years, here's what's been proven in research. Ginger has over 400 types of bioactive compounds, including phenols and terpenes. Phenols protect plants from UV radiation, pathogens, parasites, predators, and contribute to the plant's color while terpenes are responsible for the plant's aroma and the flavor. Terpenes also play a role in ginger's health benefits. They've been shown to possess antioxidant properties, anti-ulcer, and anti-cancer properties. For instance, one specific terpene called beta-alamine can stop the cellular division of glioma, which is a form of brain tumor. It can evoke cell death of lung cancer cells, sending patients into remission. Most terpenes will be present in the essential oils of ginger. However, phenols are the most powerful constituent of ginger with the strongest pharmacological and physiological effects on the body. There are four major biologically active compounds in this category, including gingerols, shogels, zingerone, and peridols. In recent years, studies have found that these are the four agents that possess the most potent biological activity, such as powerful antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, antimicrobial, antifungal, and anti-cancer activities. Well, let's take a look at ginger's effect on peripheral nerves. Inflammation plays a significant role in the frequency and intensity of your neuropathy symptoms. The more inflammation associated with your peripheral nerves, the stronger the symptoms, the longer lasting the symptoms will be, and the more damage that can ensue over time. 
Now, compounds like 6-gingerol and 6 gel inhibit the production of inflammatory mediators like prostaglandins and inflammatory cytokines. Now, these chemicals trigger or heighten inflammation. With their inhibition, peripheral neuropathy pain and symptoms can subside. Most of the earlier studies done on ginger and pain focused on muscle and joint pain, dysmenorrhea, which is painful periods, and migraines. However, we're beginning to see more studies surfacing on ginger's role with nerve pain. In fact, one study showed that ginger root mitigated the symptoms of diabetic peripheral neuropathy. Although there's not a tremendous amount of research that's been published on this topic yet, all you have to do is look at the physiological effects on the body. And here's what I mean. If many types of nerve pain are the result of increased inflammation due to either prostaglandins or cytokines, and if ginger has been proven to lower prostaglandin and cytokine production, then it would stand to valid scientific reasoning that ginger may very well have a significant role in the reduction of nerve pain and symptoms. Now, besides pain and inflammation reduction, there are several other health benefits. Ginger has also been found to be extremely effective in preventing nausea and vomiting. It can enhance digestion and aid in the healing of gastric ulcers. It has also been shown in research to reduce both acute and chronic colitis symptoms. It's also been shown to reduce arthritis pain and inflammation. Studies have also found that ginger can reduce the risk factors of metabolic syndrome such as triglycerides, harmful lipid profiles, and insulin resistance, as well as C-reactive protein, which is a known inflammatory marker. Studies also reveal that ginger can improve symptoms of acute res respiratory distress associated with pneumonia, bronchitis, flu, and even asthma. In fact, we've prescribed a very effective ginger tea to stop violent coughing spells induced by bronchial irritation, and it works within five minutes. Okay, moving on to part three, how to incorporate ginger into your diet. I'm gonna share with you an incredible elixir in the form of a tea. It's extremely effective and tastes great. We always recommend making a nice large batch of it and placing it in a thermos or a glass bottle and then refrigerating it. Here's what you're gonna need. 32 ounces of spring water or purified water, two ounces of ginger root, raw and cleaned, two fresh lemons, and one third cup raw honey. Now, step one, place the ginger into a food processor to mince. In step two, you're gonna juice both lemons and then set aside. On to step three, place water in a pot and bring it to a boil stovetop. Step four, add minced ginger, reduce heat, and simmer for 20 minutes. Step five, remove from heat and let it stand for five minutes. Step six, add honey and the fresh lemon juice, stir until mixed well. For additional sweetness, if necessary, you can use monk fruit or stevia. Drink up and enjoy. Now, one more thing I wanna share with you. There's a monumental study that revealed supplementation with ginger significantly reduced the length of hospital stays in patients with COVID. That's amazing. When trying to increase the antioxidant benefits, studies revealed that dry ginger exhibited the strongest antioxidant activity. This is because when you remove the moisture found, found in fresh ginger by drying it, the polyphenol content becomes concentrated and more potent. However, research has also shown that using fresh ginger still carries significant health benefits. For our patients, we recommend the following brands. And by the way, we didn't receive any remuneration from these brands. A liquid form, which is very potent, is by Mediherb or Herb Farm. And if you prefer capsules, then we recommend Pure Encapsulation Ginger Extract. Experts say that using two grams twice per day could help manage pain and inflammation, and this quantity is very safe to consume. Another method of incorporating ginger is with ginger essential oil. This essential oil contains a compound called zingibane, which possesses potent anti-inflammatory properties. You can rub two to three drops of the oil on the affected area a few times throughout the day. You can also diffuse it to boost your mood, or for nausea, you can rub a few drops on your stomach. Now, the essential oil brands that we use for ourselves are our acacia and young living oils. We also love throwing freshly grated ginger into our protein shakes or our smoothies to give it a little zest and great medicinal benefits. And there you have it, my fellow health explorers. 
The captivating journey of ginger from a fiery spice in the kitchen to an extraordinary natural remedy for nerve pain and so much more. It's truly incredible how this humble root has made its mark throughout history and continues to astound us with its medicinal benefits. Remember, ginger has been back with over 30 years of scientific research and its bioactive compounds have proven themselves in the arena as potent anti-inflammatory agents, antimicrobial, antioxidant, and even anti-cancer agents. Although this potent spice may not heal your peripheral neuropathy, it can do wonders in reducing your systemic inflammation and your symptoms. Before we go, I have a special request for you. If you found value in our video today, make sure you like us and share this video with others so they, they know they're not alone on this journey to recovery. And if you're hungry for more knowledge, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell to get notified when we release new content. Well, my fellow health explorers, stay curious, stay determined, and let Ginger be your companion on the path to vibrant nerve health. Cheers to the transformative power of your nature's gift and your incredible journey to great nerve health.